Computer System Lofty Goal In this lesson, you will learn about the following. What is a computer? Computer system, hardware and software, characteristics of computers. In the previous class, we learned how the computer works on the basis of the IPO cycle. Please tell us more. Sure, there are many things that you should know about the working of a computer. What is a computer? A computer can be defined as an electronic device that can accept, store and process data to produce the required result according to user directions. Computer works on the basis of the input, process and output cycle. Input takes data and instructions which we feed into it using input devices. Process stores and processes the data using the CPU. Output gives the result using output devices. Computer system A computer has a monitor, a mouse, a keyboard and a case that contains other important parts. These physical components are called hardware. These are the parts of the computer system that we can actually see and touch. Instructions which are given to hardware are called software or programs. These hardware and software together make a computer system. Computer system, hardware and software. You may wonder how the computer hardware knows what it is supposed to do. The answer is that we give it instructions in the form of software and the computer works accordingly. Hardware and software are interdependent. Without software, a computer cannot work and without hardware, no software can run. If the hardware is not there, then the software is of no use. This can be understood with the help of the example given below. Example, a computer system plays songs which are stored in a CD or a DVD. Here the computer, CD, DVD and speakers are all hardware devices while the songs are software. Hardware All the physical devices of a computer that we can touch and see are called hardware. They can be divided into different categories according to their functions. Let's see how. Device Example Input devices. These are used to enter input to the computer. Processing devices. These are used to process the input received. Output devices. These display the result of computer processing. Storage devices. Storage devices are used to store input and output for later use. Software. Software is a set of instructions that tells the computer how to perform a specific task. Software is also referred to as a program. Software does the processing work of the computer. It receives the input from the user, processes it and turns it into the output. There are different types of software used for different types of work. Software are mainly of two types. System software, application software. System Software System software is software that manages and controls computer hardware. System software basically allows the different parts of a computer to work together. Without the system software, a computer cannot operate as a single unit. Windows, Ubuntu and Mac OS are few examples of system software. Application Software Application software is designed to perform a specific task. It helps the user as a tool for easy operation of a particular type of task. MS Word, MS PowerPoint, KidPix, Picasa, Windows, Media Player are some examples of application software. Characteristics of a computer A computer is an electronic machine. It has following characteristics. Speed. Computer works at great speeds. It can do billions of calculations in a few seconds. Memory. Computers can store a large amount of data safely in its memory for future use. That is why they are so useful. 
accuracy. Computer is a very accurate machine. Diligence. Computers can do the same job again and again without getting tired or bored. Versatility. Computers can perform different types of jobs. Multitasking. The computers can do many different jobs at the same time. Limitations of computers. Computers are machines. They have to be given instructions for each step of operation. Unlike humans, they cannot think on their own or take decisions. If they receive wrong instructions, they will give wrong output. Unlike humans, computers are not creative. They simply follow instructions. Which one is correct? 